Why is it whenever an individual comes up with an amazing idea and is in a room and you have a lot of people nodding and saying yes and so forth, but then that individual gets surprised after a while that none of those ideas was executed. Let's try to use the thinking style for us to say and demonstrate what actually happens. You might have in the room individuals that belong to the different thinking styles. The individual that probably came up with the idea is more triggered by the future thinking. That's why I'm looking for possibilities. And if there are other individuals that belong to the past and or to the present, they might just be nodding, saying yes, and so forth. But the way it registers into their heads, if the idea is, is great in here, if I'm an individual that belongs to the past thinking style, therefore I'm in here, I'm going to have resistance to it. And the resistance is going to be coming from the sense that, okay, this is a nice idea, but I don't have any data to validate that idea or substantiate it in something that I can translate into my head, into tangible. And this is what actually some individuals that will be in the room would look, would be looking at it. Another one might belong to the present thinking. And if I look at it in this case, the present thinking will also have attention towards that particular idea. But the reason for them to have that particular attention is that they don't have enough information to understand what's required and what do they need to actually execute it and implement it and then monitor it and control it to its success. Now, of course, you will have individuals that belong to the future thinking that have been listening to this idea. And probably these are the ones that are going to feel so comfortable with it. And these are the ones that probably will be talking the most into these meetings. Now, when we understand what we understand, we need to start channeling our energy and changing the way we communicate so that we can benefit of each one of the thinking styles and the value each one brings onto the table. If you're interested in this topic, please join us at leadersforgood.net. We have plenty of videos and plenty of workshops that will satisfy your needs. Thank you, and we look forward to communicating again.